Get huge advantage in Metal Slug Awakening by playing it on PC with gamepad using Nox emulator. Hello everyone, welcome to Momo Candy Top 10. In this video, I'm going to show you how to play Metal Slug Awakening using Nox emulator on PC and how to configure its gamepad control. First, absolutely install Nox emulator. I suggest you to install Android 9 version 64 bit. Then search for Metal Slug Awakening and install it. Next, don't forget to plug in your gamepad. Here, gamepad I'm using is Rexus DX1 with X input driver. It's plug and play, so I don't need to install any driver. Emulator can instantly detect your gamepad. Log in your Metal Slug account and go to System Settings, select Controls, and select Custom. After that, open Keyset from Nox, or you can press Control 1 on keyboard. Drag and drop buttons such as left joystick for movement. Multi strike for firing. Here I use R1 for firing button and place some single clicks for other buttons. A for jump button, up and down for switch team, and for basic skill I use L1. Then ultimate skill button I use B. Mount vehicle I use L2 and Y for using tool. Next you can slide to right the opacity if you want to see gamepad button you have set. But if you memorize and don't want them appear on screen, just slide to 0%. Once you're done, don't forget to save. Remember that controls preference depends on you, so make sure you use preferred button to enjoy playing Metal Slug Awakening. And here is the result. The reason why I use gamepad to play Metal Slug Awakening because it's easier to jump while attacking enemies, and I can press many buttons at once very quickly. They are extremely fluid since Metal Slug Awakening is a fast-paced action game. And it's a great advantage when having combat against player in PvP mode. Definitely, this game is very competitive in PvP mode. Therefore, playing Metal Slug with Gamepad is very useful for me. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe so I can grow in this channel. Thanks for watching. Sampai jumpa. Bye bye.
Okay, it's bullet time. 